Prince Harry fears as isolated Duke of Sussex in danger of losing royal family support. Prince Harry has become very isolated following the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's decision to step down as senior figures from the royal family, according to an expert. Robert Jobson, the royal editor of the London Evening Standard, told Sky News that Prince Harry will be feeling similar to how Meghan Markle felt in the UK. Mr Jobson outlined that the Duke of Sussex's family is on the other side of the world and that Meghan and Harry's situations have completely reversed in the last two months. Mr Jobson said, Harry is very isolated now and that is the danger. Where she was saying she felt isolated in the UK and that she didn't feel there was any support, her family was on the other side of the world. What's been happening here is now the situation has been completely reversed. But what does that mean for Harry? Last month Prince Harry was warned freaks of nature could target him and Meghan Markle in Canada by former head of royal protection Di Davis. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have announced that they will split their time between the UK and Canada. Mr Davis told Talkertio's Mike Graham that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's status meant that they were at risk even in a country that is very safe like Canada. The royal security expert pointed out that Canada has more firearms by head in population than virtually anywhere. The royal security expert said, The truth is, there are three men now in custody who were plotting to do harm to Harry. That will not go away, unfortunately. The truth is, like it or not there are a lot of nasty people in the world. Mr Graham later said, you have said before that of course his father Prince Charles is still Colonel-in-Chief of the paratroopers. While the IRA is a relatively mundane organization now they still exist in one way shape or form. Mr Davis replied, well they do and they still have hardline nutters, freaks of nature that unfortunately think that blowing people up is the way to get what they want. Unfortunately, that is replicated around the world. Canada is a very safe place by everybody's definition but there are more firearms by head in population there than virtually anywhere. These are all issues that somebody has to take on board. He added, unfortunately he is who he is, she is who she is and in my humble opinion they are at risk.